What's up guys, Dustin Yu here, back with the Minnesota Wild franchise mode. Uh, we're about to get into the offseason. Last time we lost to the Dallas Stars in the playoffs in the first round once again, and then Pittsburgh went on to just shellac everybody and win the Stanley Cup. Uh, but yeah, lots to do. Retired players. Uh, we got the draft. We got the re-sign. We got the free agency. Let's go. All right, let's start off with, uh, well, we can do, uh, we can do awards just real quick. So Stanley Cup, Pittsburgh Penguins, obviously last year Montreal won. President's Trophy, Boston Bruins. So Pittsburgh actually swept these guys in the conference finals. Uh, and then St. Louis and Pittsburgh in the final. Individual awards, Connor McDavid, Art Ross. Maurice Richard went to Taylor Hall. Ted Lindsay, Patrice Bergeron. Uh, Frank J. Selke went to O'Reilly. Jack Adams to Dalcole from L.A. <laughs> Bill Masterton uh, to Brendan Dillon. Okay. Um, William M. Jennings to Tuka Rask. Lee Scholes. Vesna went to Matt Murray. Con Smythe. Sidney Crosby leading his team to another Stanley Cup. Calder Memorial. Svechnikov from Detroit. Perfect. Lady Bing. Tyler Sagan. James Norris. Drew Doughty. Hart. Patrice Bergeron. So I've noticed this actually a lot, which is kind of cool. Uh, not always does the... Because typically in the old games, Art Ross Trophy, if you won the Art Ross, you won the heart. But it's kind of cool seeing, even like Maurice Richard, um, it's kind of cool seeing other people win the, the heart, which is kind of neat. Because they were the most valuable. <laughs> um, yeah. Alright, so let's sim ahead here. So we're going to have retired players. There's going to be the... Uh, the draft lottery as well. Uh, that's fine. Keep tickets. Not worried about it. All right. So draft lottery. I don't think we're even in here at all. No. Washington moved from three to one. Vegas moved from four to two. Toronto moved from nine to three, and then Ottawa, Arizona, and the Rangers all got bumped back three spots. That sucks. Uh, Winnipeg bumped. Yeah, that's pretty much it. There we go. Central scouting. Uh, yeah, we don't even need to look at that right now. So retired players is right here. And then we get into the draft interviews. All right, so player retirements. I don't know if we'd have anybody. We don't really have anybody older on our team. Uh, let's just look at our team first. It looks like Henry Zetterberg retired, but I don't think, I don't think anybody got it. <laughs> Suck it off. Uh, yeah, nobody off the wild retired, so we're, we're golden still. I kind of assumed that was the case. Uh, okay, all. So, Zetterberg, I mean, he was already retired anyways, whatever. Chara finally hung him up. Played a lot of years. He played in Chicago. Oh my gosh, that's where he signed. Uh, Dustin Bufflin. Oh, really? That's actually... That's... If, if what's happening this year is any... Any indication of what might happen? Bufflin retired at 36 in here. So that's actually really... That's really interesting. <laughs> that's really crazy, actually. Uh, Dion Phaneuf finally hung him up. He's the same age as Buff. Seabrook, also 36. Why are you guys retiring at 36? Lee Stepniak, who actually retired this year as well. Uh, Callahan, 36. I'm pretty sure he's not playing either this year. Kyle Brodziak. Ron, Ron Hainsey. Rookie Ron Hainsey. Uh, Clarky, there he is, Captain Clark. There's actually a lot of dudes in here. Uh, anyways. No, Hainsey, I know, right? <laughs> um, that's it, Jeff Glass and Sammy Atacani. That's retired. That, that was two goalies. Two whole goalies in there. Uh, retire. Yeah, well, Char is pretty old, right? Like, he's 44 right now in this game, so... He played till he was at least 43, which is pretty nutty. All right, let's see if any of them become coaches. Coach retirement. So there's a bunch of coaches that did retire. Uh, okay. Uh, retired players that are now a scout. Ooh, so Ron Hazy, uh, Henrik Zetterberg, and Dustin Bufflin, all scouts now. I wouldn't actually mind picking up one of those guys. That'd be kind of dope. Bufflin's actually from Minnesota, so that would actually make sense. We should try and get him as a scout. Uh, okay, so no coaching. No coaches. Nobody turned into a coach. 
draft interviews. Okay, let's go to draft class. So I don't, I actually have no idea where we're drafting. I have no clue. Okay, we're actually not that bad. Where are we? So we're in the 15 to 17 range, I guess. Uh, okay, so what do we, what do we even need, really? I kind of feel like we're picking a lot of, I mean, it's, we kind of need some scoring. A, a Ukrainian scorer would be nice. Um, ooh, Mikhail Datsuk. If anybody has any suggestions, please let me know, because I don't, I don't really, yeah, I think, oh yeah, we have two firsts, I forgot about that. Yeah, I think scoring's kind of like our main issue here. Elite power forward, potentially. That guy's a bust, so we're not going to go after him. Okay. I'm actually curious if there's any gems. Are there any? Nope. Okay. No gems. Okay. Got it. So, yeah, I think I'm going to... I think we're going to go after the sniper, I believe. Oh, I, I'm assuming he's a sniper. We actually don't know. So, let's interview him. All right, let's try to do this quick. Uh, thank you so much for meeting me. I want to get it. I want to know what his play style is. Uh, play style. Okay. How do you play on the ice? Making passes and using my vision to make plays. So he's clearly not a sniper. He's a playmaker. Uh, okay, readiness. A few seasons. Okay, so at least three years. That's that's kind of bad. Yeah, or our only scoring is Fiala for sure. Uh, I guess skills, strength and weaknesses. I don't really. I'll just go with strengths. That's all that really matters, I guess. Uh, skating fast, most cool. Accelerate, cool. All right. So that dude's a playmaker. So three years skating playmaker. Okay, gotcha. So like, do I? Uh, who's it? But then like, I don't know what this guy's like, right? He had. He actually put up some points in the dub. That's pretty solid. This guy actually, I shouldn't even look at him. Uh, this guy looks like he put up some points for us. It's always good to just cycle through, I guess, really. Uh, dude, I might interview that that uh, other guy here. S stink. Stank oven. <laughs> Logan Stank oven. All right, let's do this. I want to make sure. I just want to see what this guy's actually like, because he scored a lot of points. Give me a break down here. Forward feel like comedy with both ends of the ice. Okay, so he is a two-way forward. Old stanky. Yeah, we gotta get him now. Two years. That's not bad. Uh, and then skills. If he if he's a two-way forward that can score like a Patrice Bergeron, like that'd be nice. Let's go with the strengths here. Defensive skill set. Oh, okay. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Stank oven. Thanks, buddy. Two years. Strengths defense. Two forward. Okay. Mr. Stanky. The old Stankinator. Uh, I don't really have. I don't know why we never. Like, we gotta get Buff going here. We gotta get him as a scout here. <laughs> he's, he's a beaut. Yeah. Uh, okay. And then down here, this guy is a bust. So we're not even gonna look at him, unfortunately. What about this guy though? Ooh, what the heck? He is SHL though. Hmm, what the heck? Why does it show? Oh, it just says. Okay, that's where they're from. I got it. Uh, oof. oof. I don't know, man. There's a sniper at pick 13. I think that's who we. Uh, who is that? Is that what you mean? Oh, down here. Bottom six sniper. Kyle Krik Krinkovic. We'd have to trade up, though. And he only had 24 goals as a sniper, so... I don't think he's actually a sniper. I'd expect more than 20 goals for a sniper in the WHL, that's for sure. Trevor Dubnik. Um, Bill McClement, holy! Who's this dude? U.S. Central. Look at the points, though. 
That's like pretty solid, man. We gotta look at him. We could always take a chance on this dude, but yeah, I'm not too sure. Okay, let's. I'm just curious. Uh... What is this? Hold on. Scout rank 25. So we're saying he goes. It should be earlier. Previous season ranking 28. This guy's. Screw it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna interview this dude. I'm curious. We might not even get him, right? Like you never know. All right, here we go. Let's do this. Play style. Breakdown of your play. Strong forward. He likes to drive the net. So power forward. Okay. So he is a power forward. Readiness. Four years. <gasps> oh, did I just? Oops. <laughs> I asked him the same question. Oops. <laughs> Oopsie doodles. That was a bad uh, mistake. Hmm. Four years. I wish you had more than three interviews, man. Can I scout this dude? No. No scouts in the U.S. Apparently. We gotta get Bob and just get him in the U.S. Get him going. Okay, so those were our three interviews. I didn't really. I don't feel. <laughs> I don't feel much better about our uh, draft over that. But uh, let's just go here. Maybe view draft class. See, I kind of wish in this. Oh, you can go to the draft board. Never mind. I was like, I wish you could see where you're actually drafting. So we got first 16, first 29th, second 16, third 12, third fourth. Uh, okay. 5th, 16, 6, 16, 7, 16. Uh, oh my god, look at our depth. Overall E, okay. Got it. Defense depth is A though, so that's good. Goalie, C. Yeah, that makes sense. I feel like our defense is actually pretty solid. So I think we just gotta go all out forwards in this draft. I would agree with that. Our depth is not very good. Alright. Alright, let's do it. Or do I make a move and try and... Hmm, do we try and move up a little bit? A late... See, that's weird though when they say they're a sniper and they have seven goals. I'm like, oh, oh my god. Tuzolino. Who are you? Oh my god, Trevor Wong. Oof. Holy... I'd almost say he's better than mm, 41 and 50, 49 and 65. Oh my gosh. Uh, what does E overall mean? It's it's basically like A to E, I think, or A to F. Basically, they just like um, kind of ranks how good your depth is based on, I think, the entire league kind of thing. Uh, Winnipeg Ice. Dude, I don't know. This guy looks pretty sick. If we traded two first and got him instead... I'd be a little. I'd be pretty happy with that. Okay. I don't know. We'll see if we can. We'll, we'll see if anybody wants to trade up. Uh, we'll advance day. We'll see if anybody wants to trade or uh, sorry, trade down. And we'll see if we can actually make anything work. Uh, can you do the trade? No. I was like, can you do the trading block or trade finder in the draft? I don't know if you can. Because that kid looks solid. Okay, Toronto wants to trade. Uh, offer trade, find a trade. Okay, here we go. That's what we want. So, let's go to Toronto. Let's see if what it would take to get the third overall. Because that, like, that playmaker actually looks so sick. Uh, draft picks. I'm just curious. First overall. Or, first, sorry, first round. Uh, just find trade. That's it. Uh, oh, open block. Let's do an open block. So they want Shattenkirk, Vakaninen, Vegas third, Detroit third for their first. Okay, well Vakaninen's not on there. I wouldn't. I could give up Shattenkirk. I don't really care. Shattenkirk's whatever. Uh, would they take a first though instead? Because like they're not even asking for a first back. Oh, they don't even want a first, eh? Like if I give them the 29, took off this guy. How how solid is that? Shattenkirk is whatever. We can replace him. Like, in free agency? I don't care. That's fine. I don't even think he had a great year either. Like, he didn't really do much for us. He was minus 15. Cool. 
Uh, two thirds, I'm willing to give that up for a first overall. Uh, maybe we could get rid of our second third and put like a fourth in there. Leafs take on more salary. Oh, we don't have another. We don't have a fourth. Okay. If they take anything next year. Uh, cause I kind of want to. I kind of want picks this year. So if we put that in there, maybe take off Vegas. Uh, I'm okay with that next year's third because I want players this year so we're giving up a, a third let's just see what they say rejected trade box service came in handy however you're quite off in value uh, not really not really though am I I don't think so let's give him a seven it's probably gonna get me down okay. uh, maybe next year or something else Next year, fourth. It's probably not gonna happen. Okay, hold on. I need to trade. Uh, is this? Am I back to trade finder? Hold on. Oh, oh, oh! Trade for pick. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. what's going on here? Hold on. Hold on. Timeout. How do I call timeout? Oh, I can't call time up. Uh, fine trade. Okay. Oh, we're running, we're running out of time. It's gonna, uh, it's gonna happen. Don't do it, Toronto. Draft pick first. Fine trade open. There might have, there might have actually been more options. I didn't even look. Second round. Okay, so tuck. Ah, I don't really want to give up. Back and nine in though. Son of a. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm okay with the two thirds. I guess I'm not like super okay with it, but. Uh, back in nine, and I don't want to give up. So who's who's close to him in value? Nobody, eh? Son of a. Uh, what if I just how how much different is that first? I give him our first first. I think they just want the depth, right? What if I swap that out, boom. Trade rejected. You son of a. You son. Of, okay, they obviously want like a prospect. Uh, skaters matching block. They want some kind of prospect. We don't really have anything except for <laughs> son of a. Uh, yeah, there's literally nothing. Rookie skaters. I don't know what to do. Uh, obviously they want defense too, eh? Yeah, I don't think we can give them anything. Top 6D. Yeah, I don't think there's anything we can do. Fudge. Uh, I'm trying to think. If I give them another pick they want. I think we already kind of tried that. Maybe I'll give them a second for next year? Oh, they didn't even want that. Son of a... Why, what is wrong with Toronto? Go away. Third, uh, third rounder next year. Sec Let's just give them a second, see if they'll take that. Boom. Okay, boom. Got it. We... No, I don't want to give them the 16th. I want to keep that for sure. There we go. Okay. That's all that, that's all that matters. Okay, so who went first here? No! Fuck. Two Zelina went first. I didn't even see that. Or no, that's not who I want, right? Is it? No. Was that him? I don't think that was him. It might have been him. <laughs> I don't. I don't think it was him. Yeah, it was Wong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. Yeah, it was Wong. That's what we want. Boom, Wonger. I'm kind of curious what this guy's like, though. Yeah, we're going to take Wong. Yeah, it was Wong. Sorry, I was just... I got caught up. 76 Elite Medium. Okay. So he's not quite ready, but that's okay. Uh, Sim pick. I want to see... 
Sillinger. Where's that sniper? Wasn't there a sniper in there? Ah, uh, 81 sniper. Son of a... He was small, though, so whatever. Okay. It's him to pick 16. Give him 16! Oh, they took Krankovic. 69er. Uh, okay, crank that soldier boy. <sighs> okay, so we got... Should we just go stank oven and just... <laughs> Where do I go? Stank oven had a lot of points for a two-way forward. I kind of like him. I think I'm going to take him. St old stanky, let's go. Top six, old stanky. 70 overall. Okay, that's fine. Uh, okay, sim to our next pick. So we got rid of a lot of stuff. Let's just see what else was in here. Lamba. There's a couple low, low overall guys, but not the a lot of top sixes. Okay. Captain Stanky. Yeah, let's go make him captain, eh? Holy. Uh, top four, top four, top four. Okay, we got... We just have the one pick, right? Yeah. Okay, whatever. Alright, let's see what we got here. I don't really want... A sniper... Or a defenseman, sorry. A sniper. I don't really want a sniper at all. I kind of just want dudes that look like they have one. Oh my god. For some reason, I was going so fast, I thought that was point assist. I was like, uh... Hold on a minute. Yeah, there's like nobody up here, eh? Fudge. Do I get a goalie, maybe, then? Do I go, go for a goalie? Uh... Oop. Sorry, one. Leadership angles, breakaways, endurance, fringe starter... NHL ETA four years, eh, maybe not. Yeah, I thought he, I thought he had fifteen hundred assists. Or do I take a defenseman? He just doesn't look that great. There's like nobody in here though. That's not very good. Um, do you have anybody else? In here? Samuel Ladd. Yeah, we do have a couple goalie prospects already. Could take a chance on him. He doesn't look terrible. Four years, though. Dude, that's tough. Uh, we don't really have... I don't know what's going on with our scouting. we got to figure that out. I, I got to start getting into the scouting a bit more, I think. Go defenseman. Yeah. Maybe I just go with the recommended pick. Our scout has him ranked at 43. We're in the 47th pick already, so he's got to be okay, maybe. Screw it. Top six, medium. There we go. Okay. Uh, Sim to our next pick. So we got rid of a bunch of our picks. We got rid of all three. Like, got rid of our third and fourth rounders, which kind of sucks. But I think Wong is going to be worth it, so. Uh... 140 pick, scout rank 203. Why would this be in our recommended picks? That makes zero sense. Uh, hmm. I wish you could s s like sort by stats. Yeah, our, our, our scouts are going on road trips getting loaded. Oh my god. Right, ah. Who's this guy? Oh, here we go. What guy's rank is this? 147? Let's take him. Alexander David, sure. Bottom six. Perfect. <laughs> That's exactly what we need. Alright, here we go. Uh. I'm just gonna look for somebody who has points, maybe. Right wing. Hmm. Oh, hello. That guy has quite a few points. That's not bad. Same as this guy, actually. Jeremy Martin. Left wing. Two way forward. 
Uh, potentially. <laughs> Grinder. Oh, is this Alex Morozov? Like, I think if this if the simming is giving them stats, like they obviously have to be okay. Unless they just have a good overall, but they have terrible. Yeah, whatever. Never know. HL top six, great. We're just we're going off the rails here. I don't know. All right. Um, Stahlberg sniper. Do we have any information? Leadership, shot utilization, characters, skating, offense, and consistency. Five years. Whew. No thanks. Uh, nice grinder, maybe? Five years. Is there anybody that's not five years? No information. No information. No information. No information. Five years. <laughs> There's nothing in here, is there? No. Oh man. Is this our last pick? Might be actually. Uh, 61. Let's just look for somebody at points again. Not that that's doing very well for us, but. All right, here we go. Matthew Culling. Okay, you're you're hired. It's probably terrible. HL. <laughs> Oh man. Yeah, we need to focus on our scouting a bit more, I think. Sim entire draft, whatever. Okay. So Wong, I think Wong was worth it. Because we need we need somebody like him in our team. For show. Sure. Alright, let's just take a quick peek at these guys. Uh, I think I'm gonna just fly through uh, resign. Um try anyways. Unsigned. Yeah, Wong's already a 76, so he might actually be ready to go next year. I think he was worth it. He's 5'8", though. He's tiny. Leap medium. Full career stats. I like that. That's cool. Yeah, he had 77 points last year. 114 points this year. It's pretty solid numbers. What's his face-offs? 49. Oof, that's actually not bad at all. It is face off. I always find him 78. Wow. Yeah, I mean, he might actually crack our lineup. That's pretty uh, solid, actually. Stan Coven. Here we go. 70 overall. Right wing, two way forward. Defense awareness, 83. His shooting is not very good, though. Okay. That's okay. Alright, whatever. So, actually, before we jump, oh, can I, no, I can't, I can't go ahead a day until you actually get into the resign. That kind of sucks. All right, so in the interest of saving time, I'm not going to go through and show you guys all the signing stuff. I'm going to try something different. So I made a signed and departed uh, graphic, basically, just to show you guys what we've done. So we signed Donato, Stahl, Brodine, Dubnik, Erickson, Eck, Hartman, Felino. Uh, departed, Backes, Hunt, Dumont, Mayhew, Sokolov, Elaine, Johnson. Uh, Two-way players, we signed Sealer, Bitten, Shaw, and Paterin. And then ELC signed LaPierre, Wong, Beckham, and Vic Versteeg. Um, and then also we signed Scout Dustin Bufflin, uh, Minnesota native. So we're bringing him into the organization. So... Yeah, I'm going to start doing this, I think, just cause it saves like 20 minutes of time. So if you have any other uh, feedback or suggestions on this kind of kind of format, let me know, all right? Pro Scout on the line. You messed with my trade block. Thanks. How about you don't? <laughs> yeah, 100k more. Now they're balls in. Currently have 37. Okay, so we got to we got to make some moves here in the All right, so let's let's look at our depth real fast and then we'll we'll head into free agency. Main roster, okay. So centers. Donato. Okay, boom. We're talking Stahl. Boom. We're talking Kunit. Boom. We're talking Erickson Eck. Yep, okay. Wong. I think Wong also might like one of these guys might have to slot into a wing position. So that's okay. Yeah, definitely. Fiala, we're talking Greenway. We're talking Felino. Okay, so we probably need a left winger. Right wing, we're talking Tuck. Zuccarello. What the hell happened to him? 82? Hartman. 
Levo, and okay, JT Brown. <sighs> yeah, so I'm thinking a left wing or a right wing. That's like a bona fide sniper. We got 16 million. Bonafide sniper. And then one of these guys is going to have to slot in the wing. Defense. Uh, Petronas with Dumba. That's a, that's a solid one to you. Boom, boom, boom. I don't like that they're both right, though. Rodin. Back in nine. I think my baby's really crying. Um, <laughs> whoa. I can hear him. I'm like, oh my goodness. Wild. Put JT on waivers. <laughs> That'd be funny. Uh, okay. In the system. Uh, Menel. Okay. Uh, be nice to get at least a top four because we got rid of Shattenkirk. I'm okay with these two guys. So I'm thinking top four D man. Top 4 D-Man and, like, some kind of sniper. Somebody who's going to score for us. Okay, let's do it. Free agency. Alright. Uh, what am I doing here? There's nobody. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, you'll face. What is going on here? Jeff Petrie? Oh my god. Chazon? Oh my god. Uh, Getzlaff. Do we bring Nick Felino in? No, probably not. Johansson. Josh Anderson. Power forward. Right wing shoots right. Bring in another power forward, maybe? Ooh, Jaden Schwartz. Yeah, that's the guy. That's who we want right there. We do have Fiala. He is a second liner. Uh, <laughs> look, who, look who's in free agency again. Ding face. Welcome back. Spurgeon. <laughs> You're thinking Schwartz? Ooh, Toffoli. He's a third liner, though. I think it's shorts. Offer contract. Uh, Arizona will have to offer him 200k more. Three years? Uh, that's okay. I'll take that. Yeah, he's gonna be. Yeah, that'll be a solid pickup. Um, and then we have two righties. Wait, what do we need? We need a left or Shattenkirk was a righty. Yeah. But do I want to? Oh my god, this this menu is so laggy sometimes. Do we split? I don't think I, I don't think I can split these guys up. Dumba and Pet Petrangelo. I don't know if I can split them up. Roll. Oh, his roll is a top four. Hmm. Yeah, we can bring in Murray as our top pairing with Petrangelo. Put Dumba on the second line. Kind of spread it out a little bit. I think that might work. Uh, UFA is... Wouldn't be too bad. Is there anything else in here? Brody. No, I'm going to say probably not. Definitely no. David Savard, nope. Alex Edler, Demir, Coburn, Goligoski. Hmm. 
Yeah, I'm going with Murray. Take Murray. Three years. Okay. Uh, we'll offer him two hundred thousand more. Yeah, there's not a whole lot. Not a whole lot here. Okay. Now, do I take an extra forward? Um, Athanasiu. Absolutely sign Adam Lowry. 90, 94 face-offs? Uh, at 1.9? Uh, yeah. I don't even care. That's a solid pickup. Whatever, man. Adam Lowry. Nice. Jaden Swartz. Nice. Uh, we just need... Ryan Murray, no! Are you kidding me, Ryan Murray? <laughs> Kulikov, are you serious? What am I supposed to do with that, Calgary? I don't think so, buddy. I don't really want Brody. To a defender. His offense isn't terrible. Screw it. He's our best option right now. Uh, three years though. Oh my god. No. No, 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 no. I will overpay for one year. Uh, hold on. How much caps we got? We got 10 million. Okay. I'll give you one year. At five and a half. Boom. One year, five and a half. Take it or leave it. He's probably gonna leave it. Uh, okay. Big trade alert. Uh, decline. Uh, big trade alert. TJ Roto is extremely happy. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Okay, fill out our decor. Alright, let's go. Pretty decent offseason. Pretty decent. Happy with it. Uh, okay, sure. Oh my god. Alright, so we got Jaden Schwartz. Um, so that'll help us out. Hopefully, a second line scorer will, will do good. And then TJ Brody. To help us out on D. So we're going to split up Dumba and Petrangelo. See if that works. Uh, we don't. That and that. Stop asking me for trades. Thank you. <laughs> we also signed Dustin Pufflin to a scouting contract. Owner goes evaluated. I didn't have any money, okay, man? Sorry. Ranta. Didn't Ranta. Wasn't he just. Signed like he was just in the free agency market. Man, Filpula is just getting bounced, <sighs> and he's gone again. Stepan Brown Larson, first backman. Oh my god! So many trades happening. So many trades. Alrighty, so that is the off season. Uh, we basically re-signed everybody. We had a decent draft. Uh, we traded up to get uh, Wong, which I think he's going to be a solid player. Um, and then we also signed uh, Schwartz, Lowry, and Brode uh, Brodeen, TJ Brody <laughs> to the team. And uh, brought along Minnesota native scout Dustin Bufflin. So he's now going to be a scout for the wild. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did so, please leave a like. 
And uh, yeah, have a great rest of your day. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching, guys.